Hello, this is Dr. Trog, and today I'm going to show you how to download and install this amazing Skyblock map. And I will also be showing you how to update the map because uh, Impulse SV and Schism have been playing this map, and you guys are awesome and have been leaving tons of suggestions on how to improve the map. So I'll be updating it. And uh, I figured it'd be important to show you guys how to do that when I come out with the updates. So the first thing you want to do, and just for demonstrations, I am going to delete my Skyblock world here. Not not my Skyblock world, but but the <laughs> the default one. And then we're gonna go to PlanetMinecraft.com/project/Skyblock4, and this will be. In the description this link here so we want to scroll down and go to download from mirror and uh, it will ask you if you want to leave and say yes this is my dropbox this is where you download it and you click download here as you can see lots of people have been downloading it so we download it save and now we can open it and uh, you might have to double click on it and figure out how to open the zip file. I use WinZip for that. So we're actually gonna go back to Minecraft to install it because this is the easiest way to get to your Minecraft folders. You go to resource packs and open resource pack folder. And now you can click on dot Minecraft and double click on saves. Now you can drag and drop the folder into this other folder and now you have the skyblock 4.02 installed and we can see this by going back to single player and it's right here okay so now we have the map installed what if say I updated the map to 4.03 how would you get the updated data pack the process of updating the data pack is almost the same as downloading the map there's just a little bit of difference. So we're gonna go to Skyblock 1.13 updater pack. I'm gonna change this to just updater pack. Um, and the link will be in the description. So we can download mirror here and continue. And then over at the side, there should be a download button. Yep, right there. And if it's not there, you can click more and hit download. Once you open this data pack download, you want to click on the folder in here, and this is the folder we want to copy. And if you're wondering what these two folders are, you don't have to worry about them unless you're updating from Skyblock 3 to Skyblock 4, which I have a video for already. So go check that one out if that's what you want. And we are going to go to our Minecraft folder exactly the same way, Minecraft or dot .minecraft folder. Now, there, here's the difference. We're going to go saves, and we're going to click on Skyblock 4, or the map you want, and you're going to click on data packs. Now, you can take your Skyblock data pack folder, drag and drop, and it's going to ask you if you want to replace these files, and click yes, you want to replace them. And that's all you have to do. Everything's updated, everything's downloaded, you have the map. And uh, why don't you stick around for the rest of the tutorials? I got one tutorial up already on how to start, and uh, soon I'll have another one up on cobblestone generators. So go ahead and check out the tutorials if you want to. But uh, thank you guys for watching, and uh, I'll hope to see you in the other videos.